what's up guys so uh, welcome back new kaiju cards everyone is talking about them since they are amazing at least uh, the new spell card um, the new spell card kaiju uh, dream is like a combination of dark hole last turn that it's also a rota for kaijus the card is insane it's um it's a perfect example if uh, yeah, it's a perfect example if uh, konami wants a certain archetype certain cards to be good they just make good cards right that's how it is that's how it goes with uh, with konami um, anyway, so three new cards and then an example duel. Since uh, um, yeah, they're early, uh, still a few cards uh, are glitched. Um, I'm also not really sure about uh, the rulings of your kaiju dream. Like uh, the two monsters need to battle happen immediately after you activate the card, or, or can you do uh, can you activate other cards uh, and go into the battle phase? It, it's it's I'm not really sure about the rulings, but uh, it's again just uh, uh, testing out the new card. So uh, yeah, this disrupt kaiju dream destroy the whole field of monsters then you can pick two monsters two kaiju monsters uh, they'll both yeah both uh, be special summoned from the deck they uh, battle it out go to the yeah of course when you go into the battle phase i believe so still new with uh, the ruling and uh, after that during the next turn you can banish your uh, kaiju dream from the grave to search any kaiju monster from your deck and add it to your hand so a crazy crazy card and then two new monsters. One is uh, the Mothra. I believe it's level uh, level eight. Indeed, uh, Mothra, pretty much the same as every kaiju monster, has that restriction. But uh, its effect is that you can remove three kaiju counters on the field to halve the attack of uh, every monsters. Uh, yeah, every monster. Uh, apologies on the field. So it's 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 like a gale, right? Uh, I believe it's just a uh, good as a one-off. But last, the last one, the big ass threat. It <laughs> it's an amazing card. The Star Destroyer. Uh, what is it called? Yizukiru? Something like that. It's a level 10 machine. And um, its effect is not once per turn. Is that when a card on a field is targeted. Especially yeah, one card. So something uh, they try to destroy your... Uh, let's say... I don't know. One of your back rows. Or uh, like to target one of your uh, kaiju monsters. You can remove three counters. Yeah, three kaiju counters. Negate the effect. And destroy another card on a field. And it has 3,300 attack. <laughs> Astonishing. Um, so yeah, uh, yeah, an example duel against uh, Cosmos. Alright, uh, one rule. Yeah, just uh, again, testing things out. The cards are just released today, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. And they are just programmed on uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro. So they are, yeah, they are still a bit uh, buggy. But this was definitely a very great, uh, very nice duel. Opponent gets to start with Cosmos. He's able to get Forerunner uh, on board. I should have called 8 earlier with the reasoning. Um, anyway, the terraforming into the Kaiju uh, Water uh, Seafront, you know, the field spell, which is pretty much the MVP uh, of every Kaiju deck. So activate that Kaiju Dream, all the monsters on the field are destroyed, and I always pick the big ass uh, threat here, the, the Star Destroyer. And uh, yeah, now it, I don't really know, I just go into the battle phase since I don't have, yeah, really have uh, any play. And uh, try to attack the opponent's uh, kaiju monster. What is it called? The uh, Ryzen, I believe its name is. The guy that gives you an extra token. But uh, the play gets interrupted by uh, Dark Destroyer. Try to activate the effect of my uh, Star Destroyer, but he has Solemn Notice. Okay, no problem. Still have the field spell search, so I just special summon a second one. Um, and I think here I had to uh, Solemn Notice his Straw Man. I think he had a rank 7 play ready. But uh, then again, that, uh, yeah, that uh, rank 10 is just so good. You can negate uh, something that targets, like here the Dark Destroyer. And on top of that, destroy one card on the field. So it's a pretty, uh, pretty good card. Uh, so anyway, during my next turn, banish uh, the Kaiju Dream, search one Kaiju monster. And here, very nice, I can just eat away uh, through his uh, Cosmo machines, through his Dark Destroyer, just tribute it with one of my Kaijus that don't really do anything if you just attack, like a Kamongus, the big spider. Again, the second one here, just uh, clear his field. And now, uh, yeah, very good position with uh, the Gradle Eagle uh, set. I think, uh, yeah, it's, it's hard to just run a, a pure Kaiju build. You have to, I think, for the moment, you have to combine it with uh, another uh, type. Yeah, another art type, like Gradles, for example. Very nice. Yosenzu is also a possibility, but here I can just nicely attack for a game. So still testing things out, waiting on the rules, waiting on confirmation about, about uh, how it is with uh, that new uh, Kaiju Dream spell card. But... Um, yeah, guys, definitely, definitely very, very fun to play with, uh, with all the new support here. So, um, yeah, feel free to leave uh, a like if you enjoyed the video. Leave them signing out. Peace.